and welcome to your gold market update charts of interest for today the 20th of december like we've seen it, analyst gold markets here overnight we saw u.s markets weak again with recession impact fears creating a fourth successive day of losses it's making the prospects of a pre-christmas rally fade pretty significantly there is time yet of course but it is looking less likely as markets are still not very happy with the way things are looking regarding growth u.s futures are just above neutral in asian trading but asian indices are following that negative u.s lead the asx is down around 0.5 percent to start the day european equity futures are also pointing to a cautious open at this stage the u.s dollar index trading near neutral despite that equity weakness and is still within a downwards trend channel slightly lower again in asia today against most currencies with the exception of the yen which is in waiting for the boj interest rate decision later this morning commodities all appear to be relatively range bound gold is just below 1800 copper is holding support at around about 380 oil is slightly higher than it was the previous day but without moving significantly higher in a five dollar range at the moment and the vix is near neutral to suggest that there isn't a massive amount of anxiety despite the sell-off but nevertheless one area which is showing some anxiety is of course cryptos the headlines coming across the wires on a daily basis are pushing cryptos further down bitcoin is now further below seventeen thousand, with further selling evident from yesterday as we've said we've got interest rate decisions out of japan but also china later this morning this afternoon we've got german ppi numbers out which will be of interest and also us housing data the weekly jobs and pce data later in the week are really the headline numbers for the week that are likely to influence markets significantly a weaker pce number would certainly help sentiment going into the final trading days of christmas a couple of charts that caught our eye this morning we'll start we're looking at the australian dollar yen you can see this bounce of established support around about 9120 looks as though we're going to move back up to 92 where that 200 ma is sitting if we look at the short term chart you can see that buying pressure going on in asia but of course we are waiting for that boj interest rate decision and policy statement that is going to be the market mover next and we've got 92 as the key level to eye to the upside on this particular currency pair parenti global was our chart of the day yesterday on the back of a strong operational report you can see there push through resistance at 115 and we've got further buy-in today which is pushed us over 120 in terms of where this might go in the medium term we still think there's plenty of upside here uh, possibly up towards this 130 level so around about another eight percent from where we are now to test 132 looks as though it could be on the cards trade safe and we'll see you again soon bye bye for now